Welcome to your last Constitution video. Woo! Today we're going to be looking at Articles 5, 6, and 7. So Article 5 sets out a procedure, actually a couple of different procedures, for how we can ratify the Constitution. The Constitution gives us two different ways to propose amendments and two different ways to ratify amendments. So the first way that we can propose an amendment to the Constitution is with a two-thirds vote in each House of Congress. And the other way we can propose an amendment is through a constitutional convention called when two-thirds of the states want a constitutional convention. Okay, those are our two options. The two ways to ratify an amendment or approve an amendment the first way is by three-fourths of the states ratifying the amendment in their legislatures, so the state legislative bodies. And the other way is if three-fourths of the states call a convention, and in those conventions, they choose to ratify the amendment, okay? We're going to look at how we've used both of those options in class. Article 6 deals with the supremacy of national law. This basically says that um, the United States Constitution is the supreme law of the land. Um, everything else has to be in keeping with the Constitution. So if there's ever a conflict uh, between the law and the Constitution, the Constitution is always going to win. And the last article in the Constitution is Article 7. And this one sets forth the requirements for ratifying the Constitution. So Article 5 deals with proposing and ratifying amendments to the Constitution, but Article 7 tells us how we need to ratify the entire Constitution before it can take effect as a government. So the Constitution says that if this is going to be our new government, then three-fourths of the states at the time had to ratify it. OK, so once nine um, of the 13 states ratified the Constitution, it went into effect. So some dates that you need to keep in mind. The Constitution uh, was written in September of 1787. It was ratified. So it was approved by the nine out of 13 states in June of 1788. And then in March of 1789, that's when the Constitution uh, or our government actually went into effect under the Constitution. So that is it. If you guys have any questions on this video, please let me know.